there's a kind of debt bomb out there. How concerned are you about a credit bubble popping? We're looking at the, the data. We're not seeing evidence of such a popping. We're not seeing evidence of delinquencies taking off. It might it happen in the future, it might, but I'm not seeing evidence of it. Households on average have very strong balance sheets. The big banks, which can be very risky for the economy, are well capitalized relative to where they were before 2008. So we're not seeing evidence of it yet. You know, can't rule it out. I mean, the Fed has come to the rescue several times, and we've talked about this in the past, of the financial markets that had grown vulnerable and brittle. So are you saying, I'm just, I'm, again, I'm asking, what, what degree of disruption would you have to see in order for the Fed to intervene? You know, it's, uh, we're a long, long way away from that. I guess I would say it that way. We are a long, long way for any kind of disruption that would warrant us stepping in in that way. Less than five months after that interview, the Fed would indeed have to step in.